Today is a very special day. Dark-minded Sith is starting his Let's Play. Banjo-Kazooie is the game. It's sure to give Sith lots of YouTube fame. Sith will play as the Baron Bird and upload many videos because he is a nerd. So come on down and be our guest and join Sith in this epic quest. I will make Sith's life a nervous wreck. Now I'm done with this opening. Where's my check? Yeah, just uh, make that out to uh, Gruntilda. Yeah. Uh, this this is a volunteer program. You, you don't get paid to do this. What? This game was brought to you by the letter N for needs a better intro. <laughs> and by the humble people at Rare who don't like don't like bugs that much, apparently. Well, at least he died quickly and not tragically. You know, it's not like he fell into s okay. Oh, hello there. How are you? Uh, well, I guess starting this game wouldn't be complete without a musical number. Are some random dancers going to get out and start kicking their feet left and right or something? No? Okay. Hello there. You're pretty cute. And, oh, excuse you! Weirdly strange misfit of the Grim Reaper family. Well, you know, might as well join in too. All we need now is one of those instruments, you know, one of those jugs where you blow into it or whatever. That's all we need to complete this wonderful hillbilly number here. This is rather catchy, I suppose. Hmm. Some odd instruments to go together. But, you know, pretty catchy. Did you like our little, little song, huh? I loved it, thanks. You'll have a record deal in no time. Hi, I am Dark-Minded Sith, and welcome to Let's Play Banjo-Kazooie for the Nintendo Entertainment System with 64-bit. Alright, file one. Banjo is off in dreamland, probably dreaming about the Bernstein Bear's mom or something. And file two, he's cooking some delicious steamed water. And File 3 is playing a very outdated Game Boy. Well, I don't want to interrupt that. And I don't want his food to get ruined. So, wake up, Banjo. It's time to start the Let's Play. Oh, well, he seems pretty happy. Ah. Uh, it was a dark and... It was a green and stormy night. Ew, a giant witch head. That can't be good. Well, the entrance is through the mouth. Uh, I hope there isn't a back door to that thing. <laughs> uh, okay, I'll stop there. Ah, quietly going up the staircase. That can't be good, can it? Ah, uh, haha. <laughs> ding pot, ding pot, by the bench. Who is the nicest looking winch? Whatever that is. Why, it's Grunty, any day. She really takes my breath away. Cough. I feel you, buddy. That is one sexy broad. I'm rather proud. My looks stand me out from the crowd. Yeah, you bet. No one stands a chance against you. You should be in America's Next Top Model. Urgh! But there's this girl. Huh? Are you kidding me? What do you mean? This cannot be. There's no one prettier than me. I'm right with you, Grunny. Who can top that? It's Tootie. Small, she's the prettiest girl of all. No, no, you must be mad. Nicer beauty can't be had. Unfortunately, I think you'll find it's Tootie. She's cute and kind. Yeah, well, we all know inner beauty doesn't matter. It's all about the outside, right? Yeah, we'll show her, Grunny. No one can top your sexiness. Yeah, that must be Tootie herself. You know, sh <sighs> Okay, Grunny, she she's got you there, seriously. I mean, who can resist those pigtails, really? Blonde pigtails. On a bear, seriously. She's got you beat, Grunny. I'm sorry. Hi there, Tootie. What are you going to do today? 
When my fat big, or not fat, when my big lazy brother wakes up, we're going on an adventure. Ah, well, so much for you. Little do you know, you're kidnapped. Ah, and there's our protagonist, sleepy protagonist. Wake up! I want to go on an adventure too. How did she hear that? She's got some good ears, doesn't she? Oh no! If Tootie thinks she's fairer than me, I'll steal her looks, and ugly she'll be. Ew. Why would you do something so cruel? Is that your brother? Oh yeah, it's definitely his, her brother. Where, Mr. Mole? I can't see him. Up there, in the sky. That voice didn't fit him. What's wrong with me? I don't think so. Who is that? Hmm. Come to me, my little pretty. You'll soon be ugly. What a pity. Ouch. That must... Luckily, we can't see what's going on. Hey, you're blowing dust all over this beautiful home. How dare you. Don't scratch and bite, my little bear. You'll soon need bigger underwear. Okay, the less I know about Tootie's underwear, the better. Oh no, she's got her. Somebody help. <sighs> no, I don't want to be in this crappy let's play. No. <laughs> oh, no. Yawn. What do you want, Kazooie? Banjo, Banjo, we have to start this really crappy let's play, and this loser's controlling us. Let's hurry up and get it over with. Alright, fine. Gotta pay the rent somehow. Yeah, yeah, laugh it up. It's not that funny. Oh, thank God I'm awake. I had this really terrible dream that this dumb kid was doing a let's play with me. Oh, no, it's true! <laughs> Hello. And who might you be? Listen up. I'm Bottles, the short-sighted mole. I'm Banjo, the far-sighted bear. Sure is a strange-looking buddy, Banjo. Can it talk? And that launched about a million arguments that you will find in this game. That one stupid insult. What is all that noise? The ugly witch Gruntilda swooped down. Uh, ugly? I beg to differ. That's one sexy woman. Calm down, Geeky. We'll get her back. Where'd she go? She flew up to her mountain lair. It's r really dangerous. So you'll probably need some training before you go up there. I need some voice acting because that was terrible. Press A if you want to teach, want me to teach you some basic moves, or press B if you think you're already good enough. Ah, you bet I am. I don't need your stupid dance moves. You bet we're good enough, goggle brain. Meet me at the top of Spiral Mountain. Okay. I'm very excited to be doing this Let's Play. This is one of my favorite games ever created on the face of the planet Earth. And destroy carrots! Yeah. My mom used to make me eat those when I was a child. And I can finally get my revenge. Honey, but that's something I do like. Oh, tasty honey. You don't really eat honey that much in life, I've noticed. You eat it like, what, once every three years, maybe? Oh, and these things will increase our health. Because, you know, Banjo's a bear after all. But, you know, we need to increase Kazooie's health, so honeycombs don't really fit there. Is there, like, the occasional bird seed lying around, maybe? I don't know. Okay, so... Spiral Mountain. We'll just delay Tootie for a little bit longer here. I'm sure she'll be okay. You know, it's not like the witch is, like, putting her in some kind of device or anything. Some kind of machine. You know, she should be okay. Ah, an extra life. This will add extra lives to our amount of lives. Which is fairly useless in this game, actually. Which is pretty sad. Uh, more angry enemies that are vegetables. I will cut you guys up and put you in my salad. Which I don't eat. This place is a heaven for vegans and vegetarians. Ah, yeah, I love this game. Um, so here, this is probably my favorite game of all time. Very, very close. Um, definitely, in Ocarina of Time's probably got it beat just a little bit, but it really comes close. These enemies just don't mind dying, do they? They're just sitting there and taking it. 
They must be like suicidal, like, go ahead and kill me. I don't want to live anyway. But I mean, look what they are. They're just little grounded up things of dirt. I mean, I probably wouldn't, I wouldn't want to live either. Yeah, some of you, some of you depressed gothic, you know, poetry writers can add that to just one of your poems. You know, I'm as useless as a thing of dirt. Blah, blah, blah. Yeah. There's some inspiration for you. See, this game's full of inspiration.